So I recently upgraded my iMac desktop, and so I've got my old one, and instead of getting rid of it, I thought this would be a great tool to have in the shop. Sometimes I have to look up diagram, sometimes I just like to listen to radio or watch TV or something while I'm working on something. So I'd like it here. Challenge is I don't want it taking up valuable resources, which is my small little desk space. So my plan is to design a 3D print where I can mount it to this, this pegboard. This is a metal pegboard. So that should be able to hold it just fine. There's not a lot of great options for mounting IMAX because of their weird stand. So I thought I'd just design my own for my application because it's pegboard. So it's already kind of a weird thing. So I'm gonna design that and hopefully we'll come up with something slick that will really pull this out of the way and hold it firmly. I thought I'd take just a second to talk about my design decisions. First one is that this fits the iMac stand and even includes that taper that is on that stand. And the second one is we have a little lip down here. That's so it can't slide down. Even if these come loose, it shouldn't be able to just slide straight down. The next thing is that this is designed as a clamp. Come over and clamp that on there. And these are just standard quarter 20. And in theory, I haven't tried these yet. Let's, they should just, there we go. Let's drop in. Should be able to just screw to them. These match the inch pattern that's happening on this back wall. I wanted to make sure I get these, which is what I had on hand, which is these self-tapping screws. And they just go in there, and I wanted to make sure that this was big enough so I could get a socket down in there. So let's pick a place for this and get it mounted to the wall. I think in theory, somewhere around there. Let's try that. Nope, needs to go one higher, one higher. Okay, I think that's gonna work great. Let's get our other bolts in here. One thing that I'll point out, this was also designed with minimal supports in mind. So it was printed this direction and all it did was put in supports in these holes and only through part of it. So uh, I forgot to pop out the, there we go. Support comes right out. So now I can install all these. So the back side of these, I'm actually just gonna hot glue so they stay in place. There we go, should be good. Okay, let's get that on the wall. Seems pretty good. Figure I have the screws, so might as well put them all in. Feels pretty good.
Well, of course, nothing's easy. Hey, green light. So this is a pretty quick build. Really happy with the way it turned out. I mean, I've got a little stand here for the keyboard. I probably set the mouse up there. That's just great. It's really on there. Like, it's not coming off the wall. It has a little tilt, which is great. So this is fantastic. I'm gonna chop this one up for done and uh, move on to the next project. Thanks again for watching. Please like and subscribe.